In a horror story, the victim keeps asking why, but there can be no explanation, and there shouldn't be one. My name is Alan Wake. I'm a writer. Hello once more my faithful nerdettes and neckbeards and welcome to Pycrumb Studios here at youtube.com slash pycrumbs. I'm your host James, better known as Spider with a Pie. And uh, this is my blind play commentary of Alan Wake. And this lady is pissed at me. Because I'm trying to make it to Cauldron Lake and she don't want me to make it there. I have a feeling that I'm getting closer to the, or, I mean, of course I'm getting closer to the end of the game. I have a feeling that I'm really close from what I remember. Alice does love me. Don't you get your shitty panties in a bunch. I have to destroy a tornado. Don't know how I'm going to destroy a tornado, but I'm going to do my damnedest. If I don't deafen myself with flashbangs, that's what you think. Okay, apparently I can't win because I'm going to get knocked into the bottomless pit there. But that's cool. I didn't want to continue on my path anyways. Gee, I wonder what ammo I'm supposed to be using for this. No, I think, uh, yeah, you're right. It is all in my head, but my head is a very dangerous place to be. Uh, I'm having trouble seeing anything that right now. Okay, apparently I did something properly. I killed a tornado with a flare gun. You ain't got shit on me. I'm Alan fucking Wake. Careful, a rider. That's right, I just gave him a new name to his name. Alan fucking Wake, careful, a rider. Yeah, you better jump in with that clicker, boy. We gotta go get... Thomas Zane in his diving suit looks like a fucking big daddy. Hell. I don't know what's going on right now. Oh, I'm awake. I just got it. His name is A. Wake. Baby, <laughs> you were having a bad dream. No, I, I got that before. It was just another nightmare. I think this is the nightmare. No. Everything's fine. You're home. It wasn't a dream. Everything's fine. Oh, Turn trippy voice on. means uh, lies are being Turn told. The on. I don't want to have sex with the old lady. Shh, baby. The power's out. There's no light. Come back to bed and I'll make you forget all about your fear in the dark. My fear? It's your fear. Why aren't you afraid? You're not Alice. Turn the lights on now. Where's the clicker? What did you do with it? Alan? You're scaring me now. Come back to bed. Have you no. taken your pills? Do you want me to call Dr. Hartman? Come back to bed, Alan. Come back to bed, Tom. My name is Alan. You dumb twint. Yeah. Hey, what's up, dude? You gonna help me? Because I really need your help. I'm tripping major balls here. I think I'm stuck in like you must find your, way your manuscript or something. It stands in your way. It won't let you pass. It 
has no heart. It's filled with darkness. It must fill its heart with light. I can do that, maybe. Just, you know, shove this flashlight deep in its chest cavity and hit the button. Don't mind him, he's Mr. Scott. Your friends will meet him when you're gone. Ah, doppelganger. Save the clicker. Queen Dapopopolis. I made a shoebox. All you do is torture yourself with work you can't do anymore. No, I love you more than anything in the world. You're no, I'm not gonna write news. birds in. I'm not. Birds are fucked Who up. Who are you? What have you done with my Alice? Alan, what are you doing? Put the light back on. What are you doing, Alan? Stop! Put the light back on. It wasn't true. Nothing like that had ever happened. You're not my barber. I promise to be good. Please, untie me, you naughty boy. I will help you write your masterpiece. I will love you forever. Apparently we were doing some S&M no, shit in my book. Jagger. I made a terrible mistake. I should have never written you back. I do believe I was right. I think this is the end of now the game. Now will never get her back. I am much older than you. I can tell by looking at you. Older than your first work of art. I will find a new face to wear. Ah, someone else to dream me free. Nobody wants you free, lady person. Everyone wants you dead. Especially me. Because you fucked up my fucking vacation with my woman. And that was not cool. Okay, so what now? We shoved the fucking light switch into the old woman's chest, and now what? Did I finish writing the book or what? Come on, get I to that typewriter. I could feel Alice's presence close by. I understood what I had to do now. I knew how to write the ending to departure. With the typewriter and there's your fingers. There's light and there's darkness. Cause and effect. There's guilt and there's atonement. But the scales always need to balance. Everything has a price. That's where Zane had gone wrong. There's a long journey through the night back into the light. Why did you jump, Alice? Why did you jump? And why is she still dragging you into the pit? That's some crazy fast time lapse. And now it's day. And now I'm awake again. Or am I? Oh, see, Alice just went for a swim. Everything's good, apparently, maybe.
But where's Alan? Did I sacrifice myself to save my woman? Woman can't stand up to save her life. Alan? Yeah, I, I think he's dead slash never really existed. Alan? You're not gonna find him, Alice. Things are over. Maybe you shouldn't have pushed the guy so damn hard. Alan? You ever think about that? Anyways, that's it for this episode. And I think that's the end of the game. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, all that other good stuff. Until next time, be safe, take it easy, I'm out.